Matt, I want to start with you. You've spent years covering the border. Put what's happening here in perspective, based on what you just heard as well, more than 5,000 unaccompanied minors now in adult facilities. This is unprecedented, Martha. We've never seen numbers like these inside these Border Patrol facilities, which in some cases are jail-like, in most cases are warehouse-like. This is pretty much twice the number at the peak in 2018-19, right? And what we're seeing in some of these facilities is overcrowding that almost boggles the mind. In one facility in Donna, Texas, it has a capacity of 250 beds. There are 3,900 kids inside there. And we heard Secretary Mayorkas talking about the threat of COVID. I mean, can you imagine the kind of social distancing they have there? There is none. Um, and we're talking about children and teens. And in many cases, you have 17-year-olds in the same rooms as four-year-olds and five-year-olds. Uh, and activists with whom I'm talking to, immigration lawyers are saying this is untenable. They are extraordinarily concerned, not only of an outbreak of COVID, of the flu, but that somebody is going to get hurt. And Martha, this is something that Border Patrol and CBP officials up and down the line echo as well. Their greatest...